If you need to do any mending on the Singer Fashion Mate 3342, there is the perfect stitch. So if you're on your straight stitch, it's the third grouping over. So go one, two, here we go. And we're gonna be doing the one that's the multiple point zigzag, the black one. So it's gonna go like stitch, 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 stitch. And so if you've got a rip in your fabric and you wanna kinda of recreate the weave that was there and make something last a little bit longer, the goal is to really lay down some serious amount of stitches. So the more the closer you can bring those stitches together, the easier it will be. So let's start somewhere around one. I might shorten that up just a little bit if I feel like we can without it um, getting too close. Let's make the stitch width as wide as possible. I'm gonna put my tension back to normal from when we were doing buttonholes here. And no matter what, if you've got a rip in fabric, you need to have something underneath it. For here today, I'm just gonna have it stitched through two layers. But if I had a rip in this top piece, I need some something to support it. A piece of interfacing, a second piece of fabric would, would work just fine. So if I had an opening right about here, my goal is usually to start above it, and I usually start kind of above it and to the left side. Now we'll be using our reverse button to stitch down and then we'll hold this and we'll stitch away and down and away. And so we're gonna kind of come down, back, down, back and we're gonna work our way until all those stitches overlap each other. This is how it's going to look. Now stitch down, hold the reverse button, go back, move the fabric to where I wanna to angle to the next time and stitch. And you could do this at a nice rapid speed, just really laying down and overlapping the more and more until it's covered up to your liking. So let's give this a little bit of a look here. And you can see that you can really fill that in and it doesn't take a lot of time. If we had matched our thread to our fabric, it would have blended in perfect.